Hey, Will Dahlgren here. Just wanted to talk to you a little bit about the difference between lean mass and fat, uh, and not fat mass. We all know the difference there. Lean mass and skeletal muscle mass. Get that all the time. Like skeletal muscle, does that like include my bones? Uh, obviously it makes sense because it says skeletal in there, but it's not. So lean mass is like interchangeably used with muscle sometimes, but lean mass is just fat free mass. So anything without fat in the body is lean mass. So. You got bones, you got your, you know, if we squeegee out your muscles, got all of the water out there, that's fat-free mass. You know, any water in the body, which your body should be mostly water, is in fat-free mass. Uh, skeletal muscle mass is the, the muscles we can influence with diet and exercise. So we can say, hey, shoulders press. Those are skeletal muscles, the ones that are attached to our bones that we can tell and move. Now we have like smooth muscles like our lungs and our digestive tract. It's not skeletal muscle either. We have cardiac, which is our heart. Hopefully you're not increasing your cardiac muscle at the gym. Uh, that would be a, a medical condition. So the only changes we're responsible for and that we can influence are with skeletal muscle mass. Those are the ones we're moving when we head to the gym and we're exercising, right? So that's why it's, it's tracked and that's why we talk about it is because we can influence it. You know, lean mass, we can influence too, but the really, the, the, the thing that's changing the most is your muscle, your skeletal muscle. So those are the big differences. Skeletal muscle mass is just the ones that we can influence with diet and exercise. Lean mass is all fat-free mass, anything without fat in the body. If you have more questions on the differences, how you can influence them, how you can you know, pump up lean mass, uh, definitely reach out to us. We'd be happy to help. Uh, and thanks for checking out our video.